Dear everybody, today we're playing some Atlas Fallen, again I should say, because uh, they released uh, a new update, a free update, major one, called Rain of Sand. In case you don't know what Atlas Fallen is about, I'm gonna quickly introduce this one for you. On Steam they're saying, it's uh, in solo or in co-op, experience Rain of Sand, the ultimate version of Atlas Fallen. Ride the sands of a timeless land and defeat legendary monsters in spectacular action RPG combat using devastating powers. Developed by Deck 13, published by Focus Entertainment. And the tags are action, adventure and... No, action, adventure and action RPG. <laughs> All right, I will try to play this game with a control. No, not with a controller, but with mouse and keyboard. This is my last, uh, yeah, this is my last time I played this game. So, yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> we should probably start a new one, um, which I am going to do. So you can choose your difficulty. I don't, I'm not quite sure if you can change this later on, but this looks very hard. I don't know if it's even available it looks it's a bit grayed out M might be actually not even available but we're gonna we're gonna check this one out different different difficulties unnamed story easy battles are less demanding and you'll be able to focus on the story of the world and its characters gauntlet bear and normal which is probably for me offers a balanced combat experience that requires you to adapt your playstyle to the encounters then we're having tilos scourge hearts on hearts a challenging experience in which you have to face tough foes. You will need to use all game systems to your best advantage to overcome this challenge. <laughs> okay, and then you're having Nial's Nightmare. It's very hard. Your foes are relentless and put your skill to the ultimate test. Recommended for players who seek an even greater challenge. <coughs> Not me. Note, Nial's Nightmare can only be selected for new game plus. So you got to play through the game first until you're getting this one. So that's not even possible, chat. I know you want to see me doing that, but it's not possible. Phew! <laughs> I totally flew under the radar. I feel it's... Uh, oh, the, uh, no, not you, but it. Certainly not AAA, but a decent um, A8 game. Well, with a mouse, I usually put important stuff like dashing, blocking, whatever on my... So, yeah, that's actually a very good idea. I don't know why this is not like a standard one. I don't know what what's usually even there. N nothing, I feel like. Melee belts. <laughs> we'll see. Actually, I don't even remember. We'll see. Hi, dear Alex. Thank you so so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for the for the um, kind comments. Thank you. Have a good night. Yeah, sleep well. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, it's already load. Whoa. Okay, what's happening with my PC? Super. No, you can do it though. All right. Let's see. The life source of our world sleeps in the sands. Essence, prized treasure of the sun god Thelos. I do remember Eons, though, it was such a beautiful, pretty game. Enslaved to their will. We mine essence until our bodies break and fall. The lowest of us are denied even names. Every day they cross devastated lands. Every day they die, killed by sand raids or the whips of their masters. Every day. And yet Thelos remains indifferent. This endless cycle will persist into eternity, unless someone were to rise from the storm. All right. Where, where, where am I? My wrist, manacles. I must yeah, I feel a bit naked. <laughs> you're light. right, you're right. I didn't have the feeling that the difficulty was very different, so easy was not the usual story mode, like in other games, but maybe you just said that over time. Maybe, maybe. Usually I'm playing games on, on normal. Um, but we'll see. I don't know if you can change it uh, later on. Invert the camera. Why should I do that? I'm not... What's the difference? Oh, okay. Now I can feel it. Okay. No, please don't invert the camera. I can't... Oh, God. I would not be able to, to finish this game at all. Okay. Uh, my hair is long, though. Flex on the demon stream. <laughs> All right, where are we going? It is actually such a pretty game, and it's uh, heating up my room. I'm all—I'm already having 28 degrees. All right, 
Time to learn. Attack. And you're also having a secondary attack. Am I doing this with my hair? Oh, no. Not with my hair. That would be very fancy. For a second, I was just looking. Dude, I... I, <laughs> I thought I'm doing this with my hair. A voice. Perhaps... Dude, evading is also super satisfying. As long as I don't need to block, I hate blocking. <laughs> wait, wait. Wait. I do full tude poor start, but I screamer. Oops, where are my manners? Here you go, Mimi. You know what this is for. Of course, I did understand. I completely understood what you wrote, wrote, dear Des. You just arrived home, and you are not. Uh, you are not sure if I'm fully understanding uh, what you're writing. <laughs> yes, dear, dear Des. Thank you. In uh, that's insane. Thank you so so much for the 300 euro donation. I definitely know what this is for. It's um. It's um. <laughs> I am so speechless. Holy moly. Des, I'm blushing here. Thank you very, very much for the 300 euro donation. That is so, so much money. And it is it is actually for for Bubble. So I'm learning more Danish and, and Norwegian. <laughs> you are an amazing person, dear Des. Thank you so much for doing this. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you so, so much for supporting me on my journey of learning more languages, actually. The bubble funds, yes, that's super, super kind of you. I'm getting, I'm definitely getting the the lifetime um, subscription. I, I guess it's not a subscription purchase. I guess you can say, my God, Des, thank you so much. That's so much money. You're s you're actually my Patreon. Thank you so much for the support. You need a new coat so you get some month free, regardless. Um, I only saw over their price list that the lifetime one is 300 euros. Um, I don't know how that works with the coat. Um, I have no idea how that works, but I will try to figure this out. That's going to be everything after stream. <laughs> it's 99% Norwegian. That's the good part about it. So with learning Danish, I'm actually also kind of learning Norwegian. My God, Des, thank you very, very much for the support. Thank you so much for supporting me on my journey. Thank you. I really, really appreciate that. And I hope you also know this. Thank you so much. Thank you very, very much. I am... I am really overwhelmed. I'm really, really overwhelmed. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Just just thank you, Des. Thank you very, very much. I was so worried because the, the monthly fee is around 17 euros. And yeah, it would... Uh, it would actually be better just to get the lifetime license, but it's just so, so expensive. Well, let's hope they are not going bankrupt. That's my biggest fears with uh, um, with companies like that. But I want I also wanted to research about how long are they, how, how long is Bubble already existing on the market? Probably a couple of years. Well, I hope they're not going bankrupt. <laughs> Try Pimsleur. What's that, Josh? I have no idea what this is. Sounds French to me. A tiny bit with leur. Leur? Yeah. What's that, Josh? Thank you so, so much, dear, dear Des. Thank you. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Bubble has been around for 17 years. Okay. That's, um, then I shouldn't worry too much, huh? Language platform in it. I've never heard of this one. But I think I've decided to take Bubble now. Most likely. <laughs> No, I'm definitely going to use uh, Des support uh, money here for t to get the lifetime license. Big thanks to Des again. Thank you. And you see, I could understand a bit. <laughs> the movement and feeling in the game feels very satisfying for you. This is what carries the game a lot. It's super smooth, actually. It's very smooth. I'm, of course, a tiny bit out now because of the, <laughs> the amazing donation. But uh, we're going we're gonna to go back again. Dude, I'm, I'm sweating. I'm actually, I did not expect this at all. Thank you so much, Des. Since they're putting a lot of effort towards uh, war refugees, I feel they're not going anywhere anytime soon. I hope so. I really, really hope so. Lifetime sounds always very nice, but uh, if the company is going co bankrupt, you're not having access to the software anymore, and you're always downloading the, the lessons over their server, and if the servers are not there anymore, then, well, 
It's gone. I used to link on my phone for a while and learned French a bit. I, I think you are actually it's a good step to learn with Duolingo. But uh, uh, recently I finished the Danish course and then I was like, okay, what am I going to do now? Like, the Duolingo was not perfect with explaining things. Actually, they were not good at all. If I'm com I, I, did a, I did a bit of a testing bubble and the, um, the teaching methods are so much better over bubble. So, so much better. And they're actually explaining you the grammar. They are even going further than A2, like A1, A2, um, at least in German from german to danish um i saw they're also offering b1 so that's very very useful for me but duolingo is a good start and i, I did it for over 800 days i did all of my dailies i <laughs> i never missed the day and i really enjoyed that but there were some things which were not perfect didn't know i might have to check that out yeah um there is a test version unfortunately of seven days which is not much but you can definitely explore a bit and look at the courses uh, maybe you're gonna maybe you're gonna like it um duolingo is definitely cheaper i think the subscription is around seven or eight euros if i'm not wrong but bubble is so much more professional um i feel like you're gonna learn more over there do does support some explaining grammar but they don't really rain for for me they did not explain anything in gra grammar maybe other courses are better with this one um with the language you're learning but English to Danish, they did not do anything. I had to go outside of Duolingo to get the information. They could do this way, way better. Actually, they, they removed the, the grammar lessons even for me. They, they, over the two years I was using it, they got worse with the, not the support, but the, with the courses. But that might be only for my, uh, for my um, course. Maybe it's different for other. Bubble is very close to school situation. Lots of extra features like magazine coaches. Super nice. I actually don't know if I'm having the coaches as well, but I, I will check this out as well. I checked with ChatGPT what my proficiency level is. You can ask to have you write a text freehand for the third minimum word count and will evaluate your level. According to that, I am at level B2 in English and I always hear that my English is... What are the prompts you're writing there? You can, you can do this with ChatGPT. That sounds super interesting. It show I'm super interested in this one. I I made a test over a publisher's um, a book publisher, and my level was um, a two point two or something like that. It, it, I did not even think about that. Super interesting, huh? It is highly dependent on the language. I remember Russian had a lot less features compared to, oh yeah, Spanish. Like if the big language is Spanish and French, they're probably having so much more support than the, the small ones. I mean, Danish is spoken by s only 6 million people. <laughs> That's not much. But the good thing is, um, once I know Danish, I am not having trouble with reading everything in Norwegian. That's actually super, super easy for me. And I'm, I'm, I'm glad that uh, learning Danish is actually not even that hard because it's super close to to german uncorrect i saw there are tests that you can pay one bucks and so on but i'm very much into ai and i even let chat gpt correct my chat messages but post them here <laughs> i saw there are oh there you go ah corrected ah okay <laughs> damn it you're putting um so much effort into this i am just writing things down <laughs> and speaking of i'm just gonna play this game even more now all right, more monsters. What is a sand skin? Did you see that? Is this like, yeah, I can hide a bit. Oh, I can imagine this game is actually also very good with a controller. Oh, there you go. I actually don't think you can be a uh, ranged DPS here, uh, Jash, but it shows more uh, the, the professional in this game. So what is... Did you see this? But I'm, I'm pressing this once. Okay, and then it's disappearing. Looks like we're on Mars, kinda, because of the colors. The battle farmer looks like Dante's... Absolutely, you're right! That voice. Who are you? Okay. Oh, I'm also having double jump. Good. <laughs> I was worried. Okay. 
I should probably lock a target because there are quite a few here. It's very fast paced actually. I'm not seeing my HP bar yet. I guess we're doing the tutorial, that's why. Yeah, they are just waiting until I'm attacking. <laughs> but it will change. And keeping them away from me with this distance, that good, that's actually good. Oh, more. Oh, I can shut dude hammer time. <laughs> Is this some kind of an ultimate I'm charging? Every time. He's remembering. All right. Learning to sprint. Oh, this would be actually a really good game for control. Now it's too late. I'm committed. Boss time. Cannot escape. <laughs> Big boss. Who are you? Just consider ChatGPT as a tool, and since it's speciality specialty is uh, literally language processing, it's after all a large language model. Just tried it and uh, wasn't disappointed. Yeah, I, I I would like to do this test as well. That was that sounds interesting. You just need to get used to the to treating it as a human and writing that way, and it will handle <laughs> your request. <laughs> I love AI. I mean, you're training it basically. That's true. I can totally see this game being good on a controller because I just play every game as a mouse and keyboard game. Sometimes, I think. Sometimes it's just more comfy. I mean, for me, it's more comfy to play with a controller, but. FPS, there is no way I can do this with a controller. There is just no way. Who are you? I am Mimi, and I would like to represent myself this way. Um, visual type. So we are doing, I was about to say, customization here. A tiny bit. Uh, you can also randomize. But, uh... Oh, you can also choose your voice. Let me hear. Knowledge for knowledge. Sounds like a fair deal. Oh, she's actually even moving her mouth as well. The world will change. <laughs> you raised me to see the world differently, to challenge what I knew. Following you here was never in question. All right. Um, so that's the general. But now let's let's start with our hair. Here, I I don't again. I think all of them are looking very very pretty. Damn, that's a unique hairstyle here. Super cool. Oh, I like this one. Oh, I like this one. Braided hair. I love that. Also so fuzzy. I love this. Ah, oh, this is going to be a hard decision, chat. <laughs> oh, no. Everything is so pretty. Da, 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 da. I can already see Newbie is creating his character with white hair again. It's gonna be so fun in Baldur's Gate. It's gonna take me three hours just to create my character, I feel like. Braids are awesome, yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna take this one, actually. I wish I could just do this on my own. I am not able... I'm not able to do this part. I can always start from here, but never here. It's so hard. Also from the others. Oh, it's going all the way around. So pretty. All right, hair color. I am somewhere here. Oh, this is just uh, more bright. In case you want to see all the hair colors, definitely do this. I, I'm a brunetti. Brunetti. <laughs> all right. Uh, hair is done. Skin tone. Um, why can't I switch the skin tone here? Why can't I? Oh, never mind. Now it's working. Okay, you can you cannot look like Widowmaker. That's not possible. She's look she's looking a bit sick, right? When I'm taking this, it's crazy that the difference. She's looking a bit sick. Oh no no! Oh my god, she looks even more sick. Yeah, she needs some proper food, dude. I'll take this one. 
Yeah. A bit tired. Yeah, or tired. Yeah, or both. <laughs> Can we increase muscles by 300? Oh, God. <laughs> mm-hmm. And probably skipping uh, leg days or something like that. Uh, cheeks. Can we see even a difference? Oh, yeah, a tiny bit. As long as it's not going to end up like The Sims. Yeah, that's kind of... I don't want to say all the same, but... I don't think I'm going to see my character that much, right? Nah. All right. About my chin. Definitely more chins. Um, yeah, they're making quite a difference with your appearance, for sure. Longer chin. I'll just take this one. And it's about a forehead. You have four options. Yeah, it's a tiny bit different. And it's going a bit higher, I think. Hmm. Um, oh, it's a bit more. Okay, it's more, more stuff here. I, I'm just gonna take this one. All right, eye shape. Um, this might look even a bit different. Is this a, a brownish eye color? It's still looking like gray to me, though. Ah. Huh. All right. Now it looks looks a bit more sleepy. Looks a bit sus. Mm hmm. <laughs> She's like uh, raising her eyebrow a tiny bit. It feels like mm -mm, I I know what you're doing there. I'll take this one. And the eye colors. Okay, this is gray. But if you're looking from the side, it's definitely looking a bit bright, right? Mm hmm. Oh, this is so <laughs> very greenish. Okay, wow. <laughs> this is like very fakeish blue. Holy moly. Mm -hmm. Okay, no. <laughs> no, it's purple. Okay, crazy. This one is looking nice. Uh, this one is looking green, even though this is green. Okay, I'll take that one. Do you like blue, right? It's crazy. These blue colors are so fakeish. Eyebrow shape. Um. Honestly, there are... I don't think there is a big difference, so... She looks... This is more friendly. This is a bit more angry. More serious. I'll take her. Uh, okay. All right. Facial features. Uh, about our nose. She got a very cute nose. She's actually looking very, very cute. Um, the nose can definitely change your appearance for sure. Holy moly, what a difference. Also changing a bit our lips, right? She looks like she's not breathing well through her nose. Oh, you can see the biggest difference here, I guess. Damn, she looks so, so different. A good nose job is when you can't see it, actually. That was the original one. And that's the perfect nose. But we're not perfect. <laughs> I regretted how I created my character, but I comforted myself with the fact that later on, you most of the time wear a helmet anyway. Yeah, you're not gonna see yourself that much, right? Yeah, don't be too sad. I mean, you can take the helmet off, but I left it off. <laughs> you didn't want to see a character. <laughs> That's okay. All right, mouth. As long as I'm not getting some sausage lips, I'm good. Oh, she's smiling, Chad. Mm hmm. Also, a tiny bit. A small smile. Definitely not smiling anymore. I actually like this one. She looks friendly now. Should we look friendly? Yeah, I, I kind of like that. Yeah. A smile on your face makes uh, life a bit easier, I feel like. All right. Ears. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm not paying much attention to ears, not going to lie. Uh, these are definitely bigger compared to this one. Hmm. But you can... You're not having, like, ears. Um, hmm. I don't know. I'll take these, I guess. I really... <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I'm not seeing much difference. Maybe from this side. Definitely bigger. Higher. Smaller. I'll take these. You cannot look like an elf, though. 
Ah, also sent you a screenshot of my prompt for ChatGPT. Would it uh, then I'll force you in Discord? You can check it out. Thank you, Chu. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you for joining the Discord as well. Thank you very much. Uh, fake smile keeps people off your back, at least. I mean, indeed, you can see if somebody is fake smiling. The, the, um, there is a, a smile called the Duchenne smile. The Duchenne smile is actually when you're smiling with your eyes. You can definitely see that. If a person is just smiling with their mouth, that's just so mechanical. But a real smile is also with your eyes, actually. Yeah, that fake smile. A lot of people are having this fake smile on their faces. And I can definitely see this with an instant. I found looking grumpy makes people leave you alone. <laughs> True. True. Maybe that's the reason a lot of people are actually talking to me on the streets. And I'm like, why are you doing this? I guess because I'm looking friendly to them. I mean... I, I, I'm I'm okay. I'm okay with that. But it's just happening every time I'm outside. People are talking to me. Robert Williams seems to have done a good job until the last day. Ah, oh, I really loved him so so much. I so I loved him so so much. He was such a brilliant person. Oh, I feel like I always suck with these character creators. I always see people create awesome characters, and mine always look lame. At least that's my friend. Now I feel the same, Echo. I feel the same. I am watching quite a few Sims creators. And they are having amazing, really, really amazing sims there. But on the other hand, I know I cannot do, I cannot create mine like this because because I'm not having even, I'm not even owning one DLC or expansion. So I'm okay with that. But I mean, this character creation is uh, very simple. I, like I said, I don't think you can look ugly, to be honest. Outfit color, and then we're almost done. Um, we're having blue. We're having green. We're having yellowish and we're having red. You most likely gonna change this anyway, right? Uh, I have thick eyebrows that hang out a bit low, so I always. Oh, you're having this resting V face? <laughs> that can be also useful sometimes, right? Then people will always take you serious, yeah. <laughs> yeah, which is not the case for me because I'm also not a tall person and. Um, yeah, I am. I figured out when you're having a smile on your face, people are also smiling at you and it's making life a bit easier. Life is so rough anyway, right? So why not just smiling to each other sometimes and making somebody else a nice day? Um, I think we're done. I'd, I think I would like to take this colors like um, earth colors. Even though I'll, I'm a big fan of red, but this is a bit too reddish for me. So I'll just take this one. I'm looking a bit boring, but... Uh, Damn, I would like to have this uh, back here, though. Looks very sturdy. Resting bloke face. <laughs> exactly. This is exactly what I meant. All right, let's confirm a character. Um, Interested. Ah, okay. You can also hold the control button. And now we're going to go into the game. It's gonna, probably going to take some time until things are loading. Because it's not installed on my SSD, but it seems all right here. There you go. I am here. <sighs> Where are you? A voice. Hey, hey. 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 No! Easy now. It's all right. I hear you. You're okay. <gasps> what? We set up camp. The Safe. first question is, can we can we trust them? I'm, I'm alive. The race mm -hmm. attacked. You were struck down. We managed to get you back here. And the others? Many of us were lost. We recovered the bodies, but Reeve and Tracker are missing. They are still out there, amongst the wraiths. Yes, and perhaps alive. Then we must go back out there, look for them. Impossible. The guards won't let us out of the camp. I will speak to the captain. We all owe Tracker so much. Indeed. She taught us hope. But what chance do you have of finding her? I have to try. Where is Mora? In the upper camp. For Thelos' sake, be careful. Find Captain Moras. I even remember this camp. I'm walking down Why here. Thelos. Holds, uh, I took No, no, I want to see that. Damn. What's this? 
A journal required. How can I check this out uh, with I? Report aftermath of the attack. Lost a son's barrel six. Lost guards two. Alderson Heyman. Lost animals two. Lost guards two. Lost unnamed six. Remaining cards and animals recovered and secured. Files in good condition for the losses among the unnamed are to be expected. Signed, Timothy. There is even another one here, I guess. I oh, know, this is uh, some tributes. All right. Can we also talk to these people? No. Not yet, at least. Upper camp. I thought you were oh god, it looks so warm here, huh? Well, better luck next time. If the sands take you, at least we won't have to bury you. The unnamed are unsettled. They dispute the new route. Talk amongst themselves. I must admit my own doubts over the Queen's orders. Why were we sent out here? Into the wilderness. My soldiers are exhausted. I interrupted this one because uh, I thought I found a journey here. But now this is the, the menu. Give me a second. I think it's right here. Aftermath of the attack. The oh, this one. Okay. The unnamed are unsettled. I'm sorry. They dispute the new route. Talk amongst themselves. I must admit my own doubts over the Queen's orders. Why were we sent out here? Into the wilderness. My soldiers are exhausted. Traumatized by the attack. No matter. I must remain resolute. One crack in my authority and we will have a revolt. Revolution is brewing. And I will be forced to cull the lot of them. But doing so will spell our doom. This caravan cannot shed much more blood. There it is. It's nice that you can um, read everything through again. But next I'm not gonna try to interrupt. You can even hear that one uh, on the phone if a person is really smiling when they talk. That's also true. There, there are some really good factors where you can see if actually a person is really smiling or not. And I'm always hoping, because I don't have a face cam, but I always hope <laughs> that you guys can hear that I'm not fake smiling you or anything like that. Oh, there you go. Me. Unnamed. I must be allowed to leave the camp. I humbly request to leave the camp. Please, I must be allowed. I must be allowed to leave the camp. Talk to me like that again, and I'll cut you down. Okay. Mora, sir, I humbly request that you allow me to leave the camp. You wish to go out there? After such a wraith attack? There are two of our kind who might still be alive. One, known as Tracker, has been like a mother to me. Ah, yes. I have heard talk of this, Tracker. She inspires devotion amongst the unnamed. That is true, sir. I grant you permission. The guards will not stop you. It will be one less mouth to feed. Interesting perspective, huh? Okay, next time we need to be a bit more kind, I guess. Exit the camp. Am I doing this by talking to him again? Ah. Huh. You have a lot of emotion in your voice, man. <laughs> I am also considering myself as a very emotional person, actually. Mm, I would also even consider myself as uh, probably very sensitive. I am I can definitely feel the vibes in the room for sure. Can he even hear when people are saying that's also true, yeah, very true. Hi, dear Lasse, welcome to the stream. Maybe you always felt genuine and real to me, and I hope you feel you can be honest to. Oh, I hope you feel you can be honest to when not to. Oh, yeah, now I'm understanding. That's very very kind of you because. It's super important to me that I'm authentic. I think everyone is. I think it's very important for everyone, but for me, it's even more important because I'm trying to be transparent as much as possible, and wh while keeping my, my privacy a bit, you know, that's also one of the reasons why I'm not using a face cam. But hi, dear Lasse, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing good. You are still here. Yeah, I'm mean, still here. Either get back to work or continue with your death wish. I'm not gonna die, but I think you are still here. Maybe it's behind him. How can I exit the camp now? Oh, over there. Let's never mind. For a second. No, never well, mind. There's something hard. else. Oh, I've been here for Journal acquired. My former apprentice. I hope this letter finds you well. I have heard of your promotion to captain of one of our most prestigious essence caravans. Know that I'm proud of your service to a queen and to Thelos. Thelos. What's this? I've 
found him near the camp. He was trying to sneak in. Please, we need to they hid the sun. Dude, the people are so hungry. Or I will do it. Report preparing to move out. Camp fortifications are in place and secure enough to hold until the eclipse ends. The delay in the delivery will anger the enlightened, but we should arrive in time for the sun's blessing. Yeah. Oh, goodness. We'll just be quickly, uh, quick while preparing for bed, but what's this game? It looks for RPG. Yeah, it's an action RPG game, actually. And uh, we just, we, we basically just started. Okay. Um, can I leave, please? No, it's not this way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, there was something else behind the tent. Eh, not this way. Is that a pig? It is. God, it looks so warm here. Fits quite well because I'm also having 29 degrees here. Oh, that's money. Money, money, money. Um, did I just yoink money from one of the graves? No, I was just lying on top chat. I'm not a grave robber. Oh, something else. More money. I don't agree with any of this, you know. But I'm afraid I can't give you any food. The other guards, they wouldn't let me. That feeling of starving is one of the worst things ever. I hate it. And I probably was not even starving, like, like starving, starving, you know. By the loss, how many made it in the end? We didn't see anything. <laughs> I was surprised when our caravan changed route. Even more so when I overheard Did that it was on the Queen's orders. Did the loss I would have warned them about this cursed territory, but the captain has his eye on. I must be careful not to attract attention. Yeah. Hot water with the trace oh, of family recipe. Everyone who complains my gets hot water danger. only. And my mission to teach these unfortunate people hope would be over. Oh, they're also looking pretty dead to me. Ah <sighs> Yeah, it's very serious here. I was actually just planning to on alert for that. <laughs> That's kind of you, Lassa. Just a pinch of salt. Oh, who am I kidding? We don't have any salt. It's just imagining. Maybe I can find some salt. Hey Food there. without salt Friend. is, yeah, not very enjoyable. Hi. You obtain permission. Yes. Yeah. The captain expects me to die. I pray to Thelos that Tracker and Reeve are still alive. If anyone can survive out there, it is she. With such danger. I will come with you. No. You are needed here. The unnamed look to you for guidance. I wouldn't mind you getting a companion. Us, friend. Bravery I have not seen before. Take this armor. I have patched it up. It will be useful to you. Recruit garments. Modest protective garments made out of moose leather. Sewn by unnamed for the Karen supervisor. Okay, basic set of leather garments. These garments are not meant for combat and do not provide any stats. Unnamed work, uh, work wear. That's what we are wearing right now. Armor menu. This menu contains the required armors. Armors grant you a variety of stats, which affects your cap capabil capabilities in combat. So I guess it's this one, recruit garments. And how am I? Uh, I guess I need to do this one first. Oh, I can see the helmet. Damn, we're already looking so cool. And that's just the beginning, to be honest. Yeah, that's just it. And you can toggle your helmet. I I'm going to do that. Because I've got a pretty face. I don't need to hide it. <laughs> All right. This one is done. Take care now. We'll do. May Thelos guide you. Lost your courage, young man. No, no, we're just starting, right? Cooperative gameplay. It's dangerous to go alone. Cooperative gameplay is now possible. You can invite a friend to join your game via the co-op tap in the menu. Tap the menu, press I. Well, I originally, I wanted to play this in co-op, but my laptop is uh, not that strong. So we're going to play this in solo, but I'm pretty sure it's also very much enjoyable in solo. Oh, God. It's getting chased by something. Reef and 
something. Oh, else. look at the eclipse. It's looking so Not cool. Wraith. Please. I think we gotta get upstairs somehow. It's a very dark game. Can I climb? Mm, <laughs> not really. <laughs> my my harvesting brain is like, oh, can I mine this now? I mean, it was also possible in Banisher. Um, let's go down there and uh, we have to go this way anyway. The game worlds uh, are so amazing in this game. It really is. It's really a thing I remember from this game. The fun I had exploring the landscape and uh, gliding around. Join with me. That voice. This is also why from I'm also dream. thinking a lot of people actually never heard even of this one. And this game definitely des deserves the, the attention. Find the source of whispering. It's right in front of us. Can I just jump down without hurting myself? I guess that's the way to go. Oh, it sounds like The Witcher 3. <laughs> I know how much you like that game. I feel... I must... No. What? Doom Feast. Yes, it happens again. Oh, the talking one. I, I remember. See. Who? Who are you? Where are you? I do not know. All right. My God, I can help you. Use my strength. Yeah, are we having the Doomfist weapon now? Do not be afraid. Use the gold letter. Oi! More? At last, my voice is heard. What are you? Who are you? I am Niall. Oh, it's Niall called Niall. My name. I said Niall. <laughs> you are this gauntlet. Yes. No. The gauntlet reveals me to you. What is your name? Unnamed. I am. Unnamed. I am here, out here, looking for someone. I can sense life nearby. Up that cliff. Find a way out of the pit, so it showed me this way. A sense dust. You gained a sense dust, and I could not read the rest. Honestly, even played Forspoken, and as much as people criticize that game, I, it was carried by its movement system, which was just a freaking fun. Actually, I never played Forspoken, but I remember it was not getting good reviews. But that's the only thing I remember. I'm always what? saying, anyway, try out the game on your own. What Build is up it? your own opinion. Most of the time, I, I mean, if you're purchasing games over Steam, you can you can return it back or wait until streamers are playing it and you can you can still see a bit or or youtubers or even game journalists you know but uh every game s sometimes i'm also surprised like i'm playing different kind of games and some some of them are getting mixed reviews some of them are getting negative reviews and i'm just like i am not understanding this because i really had my I enjoyed playing that game, but I'm also understanding where the point is, what their point is, you know? This belonged to Tracker. She must have come this way. I sense danger. Wraith's approach. I... Uh, I'm not capable. Do not worry. I will help you wield the gauntlet. Oi! Momentum. You generate momentum by hitting and defeating foes. Momentum increases the damage you deal. Also, damage you receive. So I need to get rid of it. Momentum is temporary. If you don't hit your foes, your momentum will fade after a shot. Okay. Alright, that makes sense. Um, did we play this game? Yes, I, I played it over YouTube though. It was a what? And um, I never live streamed it. But I completely forgot how to play this game. So this is why we're starting over again. And I'm not sure if they changed the voice of Nial. Nial. Um, actually, I am not quite sure. Maybe? Did you see the new Monster Hunter gameplay stuff? No, I didn't. You're going to love the giant machine gun. <laughs> you think so? <laughs> That's also in my backlog, by the way. Mm -hmm. 
All right. The gauntlet draws the sand. Feel it around you. Feel the momentum rising. Right now, I'm feeling the damage, though. How can I see when they're attacking me? I gotta uh, get a feeling for that. Oh, like this. Maybe I should also focus them. Oi! Ascending? When you generate enough momentum, your weapons grow in size and power. You move such and so on. This is known as ascending. Oh, okay, dude! And the energy released by the gauntlet will grow. Be careful, though. More? Momentum is a double-edged sword. Mm -hmm. The more energy you harness, the stronger the race will become. Yeah, I don't know if I want that. Why are you running? There is a charm attached to the gauntlet. It is an idol. You can use an idol to heal your wounds. Oh, yeah? How? The idol. You can hear yourself by using the item with R. This can seem spawn of a charge. I actually think this game would be really better with a controller. They're also even showing this one here. <laughs> okay, um, with R. Your weapon hits restore the idol's energy. When enough energy is restored, the idol regains one of its charges. So. Nom. Okay, we can do this again, right? Thank you for trusting me. I have been held here for so long. I do not trust you yet, whoever you are. But if you help me find my friends, that would be a start. I saw someone earlier, up there. Perhaps who I am looking for. I can help you climb. Let me show you. Climb up the, the rock wall. Okay. Oh, I love double jumpers. Jump so much, jumpers. <laughs> Let me try control if you feel like it. It's uh, still early. You know what? I'm gonna do that. That's yeah. I'm gonna do that. It's plugged in. It's plugged in anyway. Um, I hope it's recognizing it while I'm in game. Double jump. I feel like I'm floating. Careful, gauntlet bearer. There are still wraiths around. Okay, light attack. Heavy attack is this one, which is not working anymore. What is this button doing? Nothing. Ah, uh, okay. And this is how I can heal myself. Yeah, maybe this is actually better. I'm gonna try that. Games like these usually work better with control. Yeah, it, it feels it feels like a controller game to me. I mean, it's also having full controller support. Find Reef. Okay. Oh, hold the hammer. Do the hammer attack. Oh, where are you going? But how can I evade now? Oh, this but Okay. And there is no... Actually... There is no energy bar, so I can just spam this forever. But I need healing, and I could do it this way. Okay. I wonder if these are crafting materials, probably. Ah. Oh. Reef, where are you? Shitty, shitty ghost. Can you believe that we played Fasmo over four years ago? Since then, I'm saying, yep, we're gonna play it again once it's fully released. <laughs> Can I run faster now? <sighs> That's where I saw a survivor. Huh? Perhaps Reef. Of inventory. What remains? I'm afraid I'll not make it out of here on my own. 
I held out fairly long after losing my caravan. I hid everything I had in the sands, but I hear the wrath nearby, race nearby. May Thelos protect me. Also need protection. What's this? Ah, oh, hello. Stop running! You can also attack, yeah. Attack from the air, but I don't know how to do them. Ah, there you go. Okay. Aris. To be honest, it goes both ways. Audiences can be very in incendiary, but there are many profession reviewers who are completely immersed in predators uh, also. That's true, yeah. That's true. You can regularly see this over Metacritic. No, meta score? No, I forgot the website for games. Meta? Meta score, I think it was called. Um, where you can see, okay, the user is rated a certain game like this, and then professionals are doing this completely different. Sometimes you, you can see a big gap like that. The fighting system is so dynamic, it's really fun. Yeah, it reminds me. Um, Devil May. Was it Devil May Cry? Mm. Oh! I saw you fight Wait, Reeves is not a gauntlet anymore. You have it. Reeve, I found you. It's it Tracker. Does thank you. <laughs> Tracker? No. She was arrested, snatched by Moras guards. What? When? When the wraiths attacked the caravan. During the chaos, they came for me too, but I escaped. Morath let me leave the camp to search for her. Then he wanted you dead. I will go back. Learn what he has done with Tracker. Your life will surely be at risk, my friend. I am only concerned for her. Be safe, Reeve. Return to the camp. Can we just jump down? I think <laughs> we can. Right? Without getting full damage. Yeah, okay. Looks good. Yeah, that's the right way. <sighs> this will not be easy. Fetch Captain Morath. Yeah, they did yes, not sir. expect me, huh? But, uh, but I'm back Stay here. Where you are, unnamed. Mm -hmm. It is the captain I wish to speak to. You're alive. Pity you didn't find your mentor. That traitor is gone. I'm told you found... Where did you get that gauntlet? It's mine now. He wants to have it, by the way. I remember. Give it to me. Mm-hmm. Nintendo power glove? <laughs> mm hmm. Don't think he's a good leader. Please. I've yeah. done nothing wrong. <laughs> you really have no idea what this relic is. It. It called to me. You. The pathetic unnamed. Impossible. Guards. It is mine now. I will harness its power. You will die. Please, no. Your tracker was hoping for emancipation. But you finding this has condemned your kind to slavery forevermore. What? What's happening? Reeves doesn't want to. Uh. Cloaker? Why well, am I thinking Do of uh, Hayden? No. I can protect you. Sandskin. Press LB to activate the Sandskin Perry Inca. Oh, that is. Oh, I was wondering what the Sandskin is doing. 
Parry incoming attacks. If red flash appears before it attacks, indicating the ideal timing to use. Oh god, I'm so bad with <laughs> blocking and parrying. But it's showing in a very good way how it works. So you're gonna wait until it flashes. Boom, okay. A success successful parry resets the cooldown of the sand skin, making it immediate, immediately usable again. Damn. LB, what's LB? Okay, that's LB. Get good scrub? Yeah. All right, let's go. My sand skin will leave them crystallized, but it will not last long. Now I just used it a bit too early. There you go. is super important makes it so much easier especially when you're getting it instantly back i, I can't believe we survived we should make for that opening oh wait whoa morath knew of you what who are you i do not know good libera but my powers i remember some of them Hand whip, mid-range weapon hitting multiple targets boasts uh, good momentum generation but low damage per hit. Um, I guess we're gonna equip it. Weapon menu. This menu allows you to assign weapon types as many as or as secondary. The menu includes basic information about each weapon type, such as its strength. Do I wanna have this though? Assign the sand whip as a secondary weapon. Okay, never mind. I we're gonna do it. So this is my secondary. Uh, furthermore, when having a weapon select, like you can press A to review to view a list of all combat moves. Wait. Okay, you can you can see the difference. Oh, wow, look at the damage difference. That's a big difference. We also having a hammer attack here. Honestly, go but uh, buy what I see in trailers, and if I like what I see there, I buy the game. I mean, Star Wars Outlaws is a no-brainer for me. Black Myth Kong looks like it too. I must admit, I am really not uh, interested in both games. Um, the day where Black Myth with Kong is getting released, um, I decided I'm going to play something else. And I hope I'm going to be able to, to play that game. It's the, the game called Dustborn. That's definitely more m my kind of a game. But yeah, I think a lot of people are waiting for, for Black Myth. For sure. Um, all right. Uh, we have two weapons now. Play both. <laughs> you can do that, right? You can definitely do that. Probably both are very, very big games anyway. I guess this is the way to go. Escape from the cave. Yeah, I don't. I don't have to. I don't have the time and not the nurse to, to play both. Off-screen indicators. Uh, when foes are out of sight, their presence is indicated with a Y. Ah, okay. Market this marker turns red when the foe stars an attack. Okay. Wait until the red marker flashes up. This indicates the idea when to use your sand skin. Okay. Come, come. Ha 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 ha! I just used it a bit too uh, too fast. Okay, it's very nice that you can heal yourself quite often, actually. And Black Kimoth is not a soul like It's an action RPG similar to Atlas Fallen, actually. I should have thought it's gonna be more like a soul like I played a bit of souls like but I'm still not a big fan of them. It's just not my my type of game, I guess. Quest complete. The sense Karen is done. Now I don't hate it, Doggy. It's just not my type of game. <laughs> I don't I'm hate lost. it. We're out. That thing. It is from my world. Hmm. The Watcher. It sees us. Stop right there! No. They won't have the gauntlet. Hmm. And prepare to die. 
You will not escape again. Look. There. Silence. Remove the gauntlet from that unnamed. Captain! The Watcher! It's the Queen! What's happening? Go! Now! Quickly! Faster! Faster! Great. Another forest fire. It's more like Devil May Cry. Yeah, I can I can see I, I can see this game is also kinda like that. It's actually very fun. Oi! Oh, escape the watcher! Oh, we're What's sand happening? surfing! Well, that's cool. We must flee. So fast. This is breathtaking! Whee! Actually, like in Dungeons of Hinterberg, you also ice surfing. I mean, snowboarding. <laughs> You're snowboarding in one area. It's actually very cool. I shouldn't have jumped. I feel like. Never mind. To be fair, I don't think the game runs smoothly on Streamers PC. Definitely not, no. I already have a uh, hard time with Itsushima. I was going to die. The Watcher. The Queen. We must make our escape quickly. It seems you are sought by many. They would possess the power. Dude, this outfit must be made of ceramic because of the heat. Actually, not dead. Huh. Not dead. The sound guy is such a cool feature. If a game gets the movement right. Yeah. If, yeah, you're right about that. Because it can be very, very annoying as well. The physics. But it was very smooth here. Dexterity is impressive, Gauntlet Bearer. Hmm. We should be safe here. The Watcher. The Queen. What does she want with you? I... I have no memory. I remember... The Knights of Bastingar. They are no... You cannot walk here, by the way. You gotta listen. About me. Her Knights are surely just a myth. I sense them. A life force. We must leave this cavern and find them. Before the Queen catches up with us again. I sense something nearby. In the ground. That structure there? No. It's more... metal. I can see. I, I just want to say something. I really appreciate to have a companion in a game. Because you're feeling less alone. Makes such a big difference. What's this? The reacts to it. It calls me. It's like an envelope. I remember something. That structure there behind you. We can unearth it. What? Unearth how? Again. Ooh. Trust me. This one. To raise. Whoa. Oh. <sighs> that feeling. Like the sand was pouring through me. That metal object, it was broken. But there must be others. Such power to unearth what is beneath the sand should prove useful. Oh, hi, dear Cav. Welcome to the stream. 
We'll be doing well. And you had a good start to the new week. Uh, actually, true now that I think of it, in fourth book you had the mullet. Uh, you're, you're right. I can't say anything about Forspoken. Too hot, yeah. <laughs> I'm also sorry. I'm having 29 degrees. This game is heating up my room insanely. I'm suffering, but it's also fun to play this game. So far, it's <laughs> worth it. Oh, you cannot surf everywhere. What else? I'm fine. How are you? I'm I'm okay. Um, could be better though. My my stomach is hurting a lot again, which is insanely annoying because I thought it's gonna get better, but no, I'm having pain again. I can also do hook attacks. Oh. Object. It is powerful. What's this? It is an essence stone. Must temp increase your damage. Forever. Oh, this may contains your acquired essence stones, and essence stones provide you with powers and effects in combat. I thought this is like a shrine or something. Um, each essence stone can only be equipped in a specific section of the momentum gauge. The stone you can just obtain is a tier one stone recognizable by the bronze border. Oh, okay, well that's good, easy recognizable. You keep the essence stone in the matching socket with a bronze border by pressing A. Um. There you go. Sandstone rank. The symbols below in a sandstone's name show its rank. Oh, you can even see the next one. Further increase your damage. The amount of symbols indicates how strong a sandstones are and allows you to compare them. You don't own any tier 3 stone. Not yet. Sandstone rank. Oh, this is why you're collecting this stuff. Have you see there is copper ore. I, I was thinking with my farming simulator brain. You can increase the rank of an essence stone by upgrading it. Upgrading uh, essence stones requires specific plants and minerals, as well as an amount of essence dust that depends on the rank of the stone to which it's upgraded. But I didn't find any copper ore. Hope I can see them easily, though. Oh, hi, dear Manu. Welcome to the stream. Fact of the stream. Breakfast is called breakfast because it means to break the fast you've been observing since you went to sleep uh, the night before. Oh, break the fa- Ah, 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 mm, interesting. So this is where this is coming from. Can you also say this in German? Nah. Nah, not really. But it's interesting in English. Hey, dear man, welcome to the stream as well. Hope you didn't get it. I call it Brecky. <laughs> yeah, you, you guys are giving always s s cute names for everything. Telly, Brecky, Chippy. <laughs> <laughs> that needs redined leaves. Okay, interesting. Um, yep, done. This one is done. Sandstones. The power of the sandstone gets activated once your momentum reaches up to its position on the momentum gauge. Okay. Go. Keep the momentum flowing to unlock its power. <laughs> the stone responds to momentum. Oh, of course. I forgot. I can also block them. Come here. Or oh, don't come to me. Secondary attack. And ho oh, holding is looking like this. I, I honestly I feel a bit like Doomfest though. <laughs> Alright, this direction. Or oh, Bucky! <laughs> Hi, dear Angie. Welcome to the stream as well. Hope you had a good start to the new week. Welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in, guys. I always appreciate that. Okay, there is this firewall. I guess it's not this way. Whee! Instead of running, you are sand surfing. This is so cool. Whee! Oh, flying bird! No! Not birds though. But dude, look at me. I'm just floating. Find the exit of the cave. Copper ore. Ah, oh, this way. I thought I need to farm them. But that was definitely a drop. Now my question was actually the earlier. Can I raise this? Stop while I am on top of it? Yes, it's possible. Luckily, she's also able to climb a tiny bit. Nuke shroom. 
that this looks amazing here. I'm doing okay. I had a meeting where I had to sign a contract for the retraining, but because of the good weather, I thought I'd just walk here. One hour to the meeting, one hour home. I made up to 12k steps with all only that. That's nice. Actually, very nice. I'm also, usually I don't like to wait on bus stops, so I'm also usually just walking a few stops instead of just waiting. Also getting some steps done. Um, there's a chest chat. A six can increase your defense. Ooh, I'll take that one. But, hmm. Increase your damage. Can I? It's only available here, but I don't have more slot. Nah, then I'm not gonna take it. No. Okay, a sandstones in the survivability category help you stay alive. They can come in especially handy when you are high momentum. But I could not. Oh, there's also photo. Oh, you can change your difficulty. That's very good, chat. You can change this every time. So if it's getting too hard, you can always change that. So that's very, very good. Mm. I could just replace it with this one. Mm. Further increase your defense. Further increase your defense. Uh, okay, every time. Okay, I want to do more damage though. Uh, retraining will start on a Monday. Oh, that's very soon then. Very nice. Are you excited? Probably right. Tier 2 or 3. I can check it out, but I don't think there are tier 2 and 3 because... Um, wait a second. It was also having... It's also having the bronze um, frame, you know? And they said bronze bronze frame is not working with this one. Bronze is a tier 1. They need to be. It needs to have a silver... Oh, it's also here. Tier 1 is bronze entirely. All of them are having the bronze frame. Um, oh, up here. There you go. I'm okay. Another essence stone well, that's nearby. better than... Uh, I'm not doing good, right? <laughs> Always better. Hurling hammer. Hurl a hammer at your target, which will travel back to you, damaging everything. It's, oh, that's also good. You have now obtained an active sandstone which can recognize by the diamond shape. Oh, we can actually use this one. Active stones provide you with attacks and abilities in combat. Uh huh. Equip the active stone by pressing A. There you go. Oh, yeah. Cool. Oh, you can definitely customize a lot then. So it doesn't have a skill tree. But you can you can customize to your liking with tier 1, tier 2, and tier 3. But you got to find those... You, you gotta find them, basically. Active stones. You can use tier 1 active stone during combat with LTX after you have generated enough momentum. Active stones have cooldown after being used, which you can monitor in the bottom right of the screen. Okay. This one's different. Ah, over here. It is more you should try it out then. But I don't have any momentum right now. Now, unleash its powers. I think I just did. Oi. Wait, I need healing though. Oh, I need to really learn now. Where, where's my teddy bear? But honestly, it, this one is loading very fast. Never mind, there's more. Where's the burble? Can't believe I'm saying that. Copper ore, nice. Actually, we can upgrade soonish, right? Very smooth so far. Maybe we can't. Oh, I'm always pressing the run bu a button. Um, no, we also need we also need the other leaves. No, okay, never mind. I don't know how to get them. We'll figure out. I sense a draft. We are near the surface. Mushrooms. Players are reminded to stay hydrated. I sense people close by. Many people. A settlement. I hope it's gonna it be, be a, a nice seven. one. A caravan relay. Yes. It is not too far up ahead. 
Wait. There is another metal object ahead. An anvil, yes. Maybe I can remember more about the knights. Dear Kev, thank you so much for reminding me to drink something. Hmm. Mm hmm Especially with these temperatures, that's right. <clears throat> I gotta take a shot off the stream. Sitting here in 29 degrees, hell yeah! Nice. Alright, a settlement. Calabrius Desert Passage. You're probably gonna be kind here, right? Yeah. Unearth it. We require its gifts. Idol's Forge. Oh, that's the silver one. When using your idol, there is a moderate chance no charge is consumed. Nice. I'm definitely gonna take this one. And you can race here as well. Oh, that's the anvil. Was there something else here? I missed that. There's something shiny here. Oh, this is to go up, I guess. I think I'm gonna go to the anvil first. Okay, this is uh, <laughs> quite high. <laughs> Never mind. You're not the only one who is to live 29 years well. It's crazy. That's gonna be a tropical night, I feel like. Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> Corporeality. I am here. You can see me. Mm hmm. Nile. That is you. Yes. This anvil rooted in these ancient sands allows me to project myself, but not move. Curious. I am eternally grateful to you, Nile. I could not have escaped Captain Morath's wrath without you. But now I must find my friend Tracker. I suspect she has been taken to the capital. That man wants you dead. And perhaps the Queen too. The path is a dangerous one. Then I shall tread carefully. Together we need not be afraid. Especially if I were to learn who I truly am. Help me find the Knights of Bastingarn. I sent oh, you their knowledge. I will Thank you so much for the raid. Then Hello. <laughs> That's super kind of you. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, knights. everyone. I, I hope you had a good time with me. But I'm pretty sure you guys had, right? You found me, Thank you so much for the raid. And I can see you were also playing Atlas Fall. I hope you enjoyed the game. And I hope true, I'm not Niall. spoiling too much, so, even though I just started again. Yes. Let us Hi, dear. Wait a second. Of old. Together, uh, we will succeed. Tildy? Oh, God, I butchered your name, right? Oh, God. Hi, dear. Erhard Fox. Hi, dear. Carabot. Hello, dear. Fancore. Oh, hi. Hi, dear Z8. <laughs> hi, dear he No worries. I'm playing uh, on a new game. Oh, damn. Okay. I am definitely not spoiling. It. I just started, but you can probably see this one. Um, yeah, we are actually amazed by how smooth this uh, game is, even on my old PC here. Um, and how smooth the, the gameplay is, actually. Thank you for the shout out, by the way. Thank you so much. <laughs> I appreciate this as well. Um, yeah, in case, in case you are hearing some birds in the background, I know Heen is also a birdie, but um, also having uh, other birds here, um, they're singing sometimes. So uh, it's not like you're going crazy. It's because my burbles are inside. But right now they're sleeping. Right now they're a bit sleepy, so I don't think we're going to hear them. It's also so hot here. <laughs> Luckily, it's not bothering them at all. But yeah, in case you're gonna hear them, that's uh, yeah, my, my burbles there in the background. <laughs> um, yeah, we just uh, arrived here at the the new refuge place. I am not quite sure what's happening, so um, yeah, we just started the conversation with Ni. I I, I don't know how to say his name. Nial. I always want to say Nial. Now, I think it's something like that. <laughs> I'm butchering names uh, quite a lot today. Tell me about the knights. The villagers might help us. Actually, I would like to know more about the knights. The knights. Is there anything else you can recall? Hmm. I remember a kindred spirit amongst them. A friend. But 
This friend, she was unable to hear my call, unlike you. The villagers might help us then. That settlement nearby, Castrum Seven. Perhaps the people there know of the knights, though no one has seen the knights for years. There are truths even in myths. Let us head for the village. This anvil, it has brought me another memory. We should now be able to leap through the air. Oh. We can fly. Not fly, propel ourselves. Try it and you will <laughs> see. As a person who is appreciating to, to fly, because uh, gliding through the air is always something nice, right? Tag analysis, the game ran very well from the start. Issues at release included lack of decent up something like DLSS or FSR, but they fixed that. I'm glad they fixed it then. I'm glad because it's running very, very smoothly. Um, Yeah, short eight hours. Ooh, that's a long one for me. Thank you so much again for the for the raid. Um, and yeah, <laughs> I'm glad you could some some dares. I'm actually I actually did not follow if I could do some dares here. I actually did not check them out. I I'm j <laughs> I, I should have done that, huh? I'm not well prepared today. Oh boy. Um, find a piece to stabilize the content. All right, let's let's do this one first. A real combat. Some of your foes require you to take the fight to the air. You can perform the air dash with RB. Hitting your foes in the air recharges your air dash and allows you to stay airborne longer. All right, like this. I feel like I'm floating. This is so cool, but I should probably also target them. And yeah, this is insanely smooth. If I could get even higher. Okay, Burble, can you come down a bit to me? And you can use all the other abilities here as well. I'm actually surprised about that. All right. Still the gauntlet. You can stay up so long in the air. It's so actually, can we even try this here? Look at this. Okay. Could be probably a bit longer, but <laughs> it <hasn't laughs> it's not too bad. To merely jump across, ah. but for you, barely an obstacle at all. I am down here but okay i'm not dying we're gonna we're gonna do this again double jump then air dash maybe i should have run a bit okay let me try this again it is quite of a that's quite a distance huh it's not like dante's and for absolutely i agree oh that was way better and you were also kind of floating at the end yeah get a get a feeling for that He's bugging. No. Niall, what's going on? Niall. We need to stabilize this. Gauntlet bearer, you must wake. Come on. Come on. Game over. No, it's not game over. <laughs> Imagine 40 euro game. Suddenly game over. What? Get back! Forgive me. I was simply trying to help you. Are you injured? I'm fine. He looks so young <laughs> for this voice. Blinding light, a rush of air, and there you were. What are you doing out here? <laughs> I am just a humble traveler. My name is Arif, at your service. You were trying to steal this gauntlet. <laughs> Nonsense. A relic of such renown would be far too dangerous to steal. So you know of this gauntlet, its power. How do you know? Well, it's spoken of in those legends about the knights of Vastengar. You know about the knights. It is they whom I seek. Then you are at the right place, my friend. The path to Bastengar is right there. Where? Behind me. Through that gate. 
the gate that's buried in the sand. Looks like a dungeon. But that's not helpful. Then there is little hope of using it to reach Bastingar. <laughs> I suppose it depends on the size of your ambition, my friend. If you need to rest, there's a village nearby. And take this. So how's a a it's bloop. he's also having a walking stick, I just realized. It's rudimentary, but you can expect I'm not seeing many characters with that. Oh, we ha we're getting a map? I did not think of a map at all. The map can be navigated with L and done with R. Important objects are automatically marked on the map as you discover them. Press Y to switch between filter views. Press R to bring up the legend with the descriptions for each market type. Press A to set custom waypoints, which are also displayed on your comp. Damn. Um, okay, let's have a look. <laughs> Did we start here then? Okay, so now this is actually not the, the start start. This is where we came from. Ah, oh, did I miss something then? Whoa, this is... Oh my god, chat. There's so much to discover. But it's very linear so far. That's that's good. Let's meet at the village later. I'll see you around. My senses tell me not to trust that man. The path to Bastingar is behind that gate. But can we unearth it? Have you forgotten that you nearly lost your life? That the gauntlet is unstable? And even if it were not, it is not yet complete. It lacks enough power to raise something that large. You have a plan? I don't want it to explode yet again. Hmm. You know, maybe another nice thing about switching fully to bubble, you don't have to deal with this. <laughs> the match madness thing anyhow. <laughs> Actually I I didn't mind this at all. Um was also talking to Newbie about this today. Like I'm a bit sad that I lost my streak of more than eight hundred days. I did all the dailies, I did all the monthlies, I did a lot of lot of things. I was actually so committed. Um but he told me that he was a bit more stressed because of the gamification of learning a language you don't have this at all with with bubble you're just actually focusing on yourself i feel like and this is um maybe for some people for some people need the motiva motivation but i i can also see why people are disliking you know match <laughs> bad this is horrible <laughs> hi dear peace walker hope you're having a great day are you enjoying the uh, this game is amazing so far and it's even on sale um it's really good so far if you enjoy playing devil may cry um then you're also gonna enjoy this one actually it's very smooth the gameplay also Nyal is all, all like you yeah we should definitely not trust that dude and so we're gonna just trust him anyway okay yeah we that's uh, we don't have many options now it has so many complaints on the internet as well yeah i can see i can see that uh, for sure um yeah, you're right. I'm not going to deal with this in bubble anymore. <laughs> I had Atlas fall on my wish list when I first uh, heard about it. Yeah, it's it's, it's actually a decent game. Um, and they also just released a major update. So, yeah, maybe it's nice to come back again, H.O. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I don't want to explode yet again. I no. do not want it to explode yet again. I can only concur. It would be better for your health. But yes... The gauntlet can be fixed. Its pieces were scattered across the lands when it broke long ago. If we retrieve those pieces, we can reforge the gauntlet bit by bit, gaining new powers as we do so, and preventing further eruptions. Then let us find these shards, Niall. I sense a powerful piece nearby. We can start with that one. Find a piece to stabilize the gauntlet. Is not far away? Here at least. I still need... Oh, I pressed the wrong button again. Shoot. Um, I still need... Where was it? That's the map. This is our... Actually, what's this? Quest and Chaka Bruce. A silver brush with knightly heraldry. Looks fancy for an unnamed item. How did Chaka's name get carved into it? Um... Okay, that's the main quest. Away from the sun's eye and the sun's current. Okay. Um, 
these are materials uh, this is to play in co-op i actually wanted to try this in co-op now i forgot what i wanted to do i wanted to see the ah uh, ah uh, the upgrade there you go i still need those leaves actually the dying leaves ah uh, your pc is throwing you well yeah i'm also surprised about that but it's very optimized so that's very very good But I'm also not uh, playing with 60 FPS. <laughs> Definitely not. Okay. Calatra's ruins. There. The piece I sensed. This one? Looks like they're it's a bit guarded, huh? Okay. Ah, okay. I see something around it. It seems to be protected by magic. Watch out, wraiths. Ah, not a problem for us, Chad. Oh my god, that was actually perfect. A block. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> to go closer though there's this other mother trucker starting to remember more momentum we can channel it into shattering blows shatter you can spend all of your momentum to form a powerful shatter attack with Altiarty dealing with high amount of damage and leaving your foes crystallized. Shattering is available after ascending. The shatter grows more powerful the higher your momentum. To it, the attack changes if you ascend again. If you're curing target, you can defeat it by using the shatter. This is indicated by a blue outline around the health bar. Oh, that's nice. I hope I can pay attention to that. This update includes an expanded world, new enemies, revamped progression, new quest, and more. I think new quests are always nice. <laughs> It's always nice to come back. Powerful wrath encounter. More? Oh, hello there. Oh, okay. I just shattered. This one is different. It is more powerful. Okay, let me get the ed first. Also, a bit of healing. Oh, this is one is very powerful. And I don't have any healing right now. <laughs> oh, God. The music is making me nervous. No! Large wraith, What's this? Ones. Be alert. No, no, he's gonna die now. Uh, oh, okay, they're also disappearing. You will Good. now be able to take the piece. Thank you, thank you. The boss was dead. Enhance dash, please. The should be stable now, but the piece you found is still dormant. It needs enough of its shards to be properly forged into the gauntlet. Can you sense these shards too? Oh, yes. now it's looking beautiful. Let me show you. So much green. The alt senses. Press uh, this button down to activate the alt senses when active main quest objects markers at this. Oh, that's so nice. You see the beacons of light? Oh! Everyone is a shard calling out to you, to the gauntlet. Can we unearth the gate to the knights once we have them? Yes. And with that, more powers. More memories. It's like a quest tracker. It's a bit much to take in. 
I will need your help. And I will be here. I need you to be safe too. Use my senses if you lose sight of me. They will guide the way. Armor upgrades. Armor upgrades. Upgrading has been unlocked, which allows you to improve your quiet armors. Select the armor to be used upgrades by pressing A. Ooh, upgrades. Uh, upgrading improves the armor stats and increases its power level. The power level of your armor can be compared to your foe's level, so you can estimate the difficulty of a fight. Okay, so we should probably do that. Um, plus one perk token. Upgrade an armor is done using essence dust. Oh, that's why you were having essence dust. Okay. Uh, upgrade the armor by holding X. Ta -da. But I don't have enough essence dust. We have only 275 of 400, so we could have worked with that. You good at parrying or block? Ah. <laughs> I really, usually I'm not good in parrying and blocking, or at least I'm not being comfortable with. Um, usually I also play games where I'm going to be a ranged DPS, so... Um, yeah, that's still very new to me, but I'm I'm really enjoying also playing melee. But I don't think I'm gonna get fully converted though. Well, they sucked at that, or they improved it. Mm, all I know is still you gotta react insanely fast sometimes. Um. Okay, we're done. Perks. By upgrading your armor, you have received a perk token. With these, you can unlock perks in the perk menu. Oh, wait a second. This is looking like a skill tree, though. In this menu, you can invest your perk tokens to unlock or improve perks. Perks are permanent powers, which are always active regardless of which armor you are using. I love passive stuff. So uh, maybe this is passive. Now unlock your first perk by spending one perk token. Hold X to unlock the perk. What is this even? What am I unlocking? Oh, collecting plants restores a moderate amount of your idols. And oh, that's cool. You can also reset it. Generate moderate amount of momentum at the start of... Oh, that's even better. You can reset that by pressing Y. Can I just... No, you have to, to go this way. Never mind. Okay. We are uh, we're cl collecting some plants now. And, well, unfortunately, I can't do more. Uh, um, I, <laughs> I did a Sekiro no Hitra. No, but I played a bit of Sekiro and I figured out that game is nothing for me. But that's okay. Ru Ruin, not run. Ruin Rising Pack. What is this? Uh, all included items have been added to your inventory. Uh, what did I do? <laughs> Some kind of a pack? My inventory. Where can I find that even? What is it even containing? Wh what is this one? Timely crystallization. You're working it hits against slow slowed foes have a small chance to crystallize oh you chance to trigger this effect there is a moderate chance no charge is consumed hmm i like this one i'll take that one uh glad you're not a souls like player as a kid is also one of the trial games i i don't like that um i am very willing to to try them out i played a week of elden ring on stream i think we did all right um, but I didn't have this amazing feeling of, um, if, hmm. a lot of people are describing it this way, like fighting against a hard boss and defeating them is kind of giving you some kind of, um, the, the feeling of accomplishing something. I, I feel, I feel like personally, I, I want to just move on with games. I understand why when people are feeling this way, but my my steam list is just too big to spend many many hours on a boss i don't have the patience for this i would rather play another game with another story than yeah not being able to finish a game for i don't know 100 hours uh, yeah i want to progress and w what annoys me the most is uh, i know people gonna uh, people gonna hate me for saying that but i really want to i kind of want to wish there would be some different kind of uh, modes. I know it's a Souls game and they're not going to do that. But it would be nice because a lot of people are saying the story is amazing and well, I'm not going to experience that story if I am getting frustrated with yeah, getting a boss after many, many hours. I'm just... Within that time, I could finish another game, you know? 
too frustrating. I don't want to fight a boss 500 plus. Yeah, I, I, I am not a patient person. It's, I am admiring people who are very patient, but I'm really not patient. I'm also not patient in real life. How am I supposed to be patient in a video game? I feel like I'm not chilling anymore. Souls case, I'm it. <laughs> Learning with the boss is your progress, but everyone has different tech. Yeah, but that's... I would I would l rather learn another game with their story. I would rather put that learning progress and actually learning a language or something like that. I don't want to... I don't want to um, trash talk this at all. Please don't understand me uh, wrong. Please don't understand me wrong. It just doesn't feel... I'm not feeling happy afterwards. And I think that's the point. It's my leisure time and it's it's nice to try them out. It would be better if there would be different difficulties so I could also just enjoy the story mode, for example. But yeah, if people are saying and there are some elitists, they're gonna say, Yeah, get good and then you're gonna be you're gonna be able to enjoy the game or watch other content creators. It's my focus. Yeah, my focus is also very, very different. I remember how RTS was the the big thing to play, and they became worse and worse. Uh, yeah, I think RTS is uh, that's not the right time anymore. I guess. Yeah, I mean, same with MMOs. I I feel like they are not not kind of up to date anymore. If I don't defeat an enemy after a few tries, I get first in one two. A progress move on, experience the story. Yeah, I I feel the same. I feel the same. Even though we. Personally, I don't think I was doing bad in Elden Ring. I, I, I don't think so. Um, it was okayish, but I also didn't meet what was her name, Melania or Malenia or Malena, whatever her name is. I think that's more of a German name, though. But or Melania Trump, what was her name? I heard horror stories about her, and I, I, oh, I, I don't want to deal with us. No, I, <laughs> I wanna, I wanna finish games and. That's most likely not gonna happen with this one. It did very well me. Thank you. So it was not just me. I feel I felt like the, the beginning was was a bit slow paced, but you guys were saying, no, that's actually good progress. So I'm believing you. Yeah. So it's like we'll get there as well. We'll see. I just wish there would be some story mode as well, but uh yeah. Yeah. I I think Elden Ring is also it was also a bit easier because I was playing a mage. Um, that was a bit easier. Um, I could never, I, I would have never done the, this progress as a melee player, I'm pretty sure. It's so, so different. But there would be, again, there are going to be other people again saying, Yeah, oh, you played mage, it's not kind of, I don't care. I don't care, yeah. It's just, yeah, I want to enjoy playing games. I've seen people fight Melania and spend an entire day, like eight hours of fighting her. And was <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and this is... I, I don't have any nerves for that. But it's nice for people who are um, finishing the finishing the bosses, finishing the game, and they're they're able to say, yeah, that was a good game, that was a good story, and I feel like I've accomplished something. I I never had this feeling, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, I like challenges, but... <laughs> I, I don't like these kind of challenges. No. But everyone is different. It's just important that we're respecting each other, you know? That's the most important part. This game is not that hard, though. I'm playing it on normal, but uh, I I feel like this game, it, this game can be hard. This is just the beginning, so <laughs> maybe we're going to even see another boss. We'll see. Um, right now, I need to find enhanced air dash shards, and I can do that by... Wait a second, what was this here? Oh, our friend, right? The Nyal. gauntlet should be stable now. I am greatly relieved. As am I, Niall. Okay, can I talk to him again? We possess a piece of mm -hmm. the gauntlet, but we also need the shards. I can guide you to them. We will then take them to an anvil. Okay, and I think it was... Oh, I'm changing Your the... Eyes are opened now. Oh, look at this. This is so... This is so friendly towards the player. It's actually so nice. I kind of want to go to the green area first. It's the first time I'm seeing a green area. Oh my god, I need to do the... I need to run, I need to double jump and then dash, I think. 
I hope it's working this way. <laughs> I love the challenge, especially because it takes my mind off the daily stress. I kind of chill with it. I don't know. Yeah, I completely understand that. Um, maybe it's because I was thinking with which games, m the first games I started with, that was The Sims, that was Harry Potter. So those were my, my comfy games. Um, maybe it's because I did not play many, many games where I was fighting a lot. Maybe that's what it makes it a bit harder for me. Um, I played, actually I played so many strategy games back then, which I'm not doing on stream because of vex eating. But I, I, I understand um, after a long day, after a stressful day, you want to chill with Elden Ring. But yeah, I'm, I'm chilling with the easier games, I guess. Today you should have picked hard mode. Yeah, honestly, I think you can also play hard mode here. I didn't run, but I think it's fine. Look at this. She's also floating a bit. Dude, that's cool. Scouting you know, villager. Oh, Philos, where did you come from? I'm an angel. I just fell down. <laughs> Hello. How did you arrive from this side? There is literally no bridge. It's a long story. I was told there was a village nearby. Castrum 7 is right on the other side of that rope bridge. It's kind of the only bridge standing after that Watcher Fury. Watcher Fury? Yeah. For some reason, the whole ground started to shake, and down came all the bridges around these parts. Lots of people got stuck. I'm looking for the Knights of Bastingar. Do you know anything about them? Hmm. Not sure I can help you with that. You'll have to ask around at the village. But wherever you go, be careful. Mm -hmm. When the sand moves, get ready to run. And fight. Oh, what have I seen here? I like chess. Yoink. Active formula. Five. You've learned how to fuse a new sandstone. Biting sandstorm. Summon a tornado following your foes and damaging everything. Oh. Ooh, that's nice. Can I equip this now? No. Formulas allow you to create a sandstone by using specific materials. You still need to find some required materials first. Yeah, that makes sense. Like uh, with the rest. Is that a moose? Oh my god, it's so big! Do you think they were going to attack us? There is also a very big hawk. I could assume... I would assume the hawk is going to attack us. Patience. I thought it was easy, easy to put the high enemies and further into the game. Yes, yes, get quite strong. I agree. I agree. Um, the game, this game is. Uh, All is not dead. Slowly starting. Relief. You remember this place? It is familiar to me. Oh, I just like to. Oh, okay. But I think it's not chasing me, or are they running away from me? He just chilled. He, he wanted to sleep a bit. They poop. They, they poop. Maybe they also pooped here. No, nothing. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, I think this is the way, though. My senses um, are yours. Yeah. I appreciate it. Mooses are giant in real life to me. I know. I know, but I never met one. I don't think we have them in Germany, though. Are you gonna attack? Yo. Okay. Oh, okay. I had a feeling. Who wants to have some bacon? Huh? Um, I think we're not able to get some bacon. We're not. No, this is a bit too dangerous. Okay, it disappeared. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Maybe. I'm sorry, dudes. It's, it's God. It's God. But I think the the moose is not gonna attack us. Hopefully not. I think it's gonna attack us. It's looking very aggressive. Hello. No. Okay. If you're running away, then I'm not gonna. No, I'm not gonna hurt you. There's a chest though. Formula 9. You learned how to fuse new sandstone, generating parry. On a successful parry, generate a moderate amount of momentum. That would be good for people who are actually good with parrying. Tenacious parry. Great increase the duration of the sand skin. Oh. Find the newly acquired formula in the arsenal in order to fuse these stones. Can I fuse them right now? Oh, wait, no, this is bronze as well. Mimic Sherm. I cannot upgrade anything here. No. Oh, wait a second. We could do this one. Silver, though. Uh, no, it's already equipped or what? Unequipped. Oh, I think I need to go to my anvil. I think it's only possible at my anvil, right? I think the... 
We we need to go back for this. Okay, I'm not gonna go back for this right now. Artifact acquired special. Open inventory. What's this? Artifact. Uh, oh, dude, there's so much to to collect. A value can be sold to vendors. Should we should we sell this one? A rounded metal object, most likely nailed to the hooves of a horse from a time when horses still existed. They're not alive here anymore. The object is cut with gold and doesn't show any deterioration. It may have been used as an ornament. We don't have moose here, but when I see the movie, they seem like the tanks. Yeah, I think they are in existing in in Sweden. Yeah. What is this worm? Did you see that one? It was saying diver. A sandworm looks crazy. Let me help you see. Ah, it's down. No, not down, but up there. I feel like there is so much to discover here, so let's look around. Abandoned village. Town. Dun, dun, dun. It's probably everything looted. I love my double jump. Oh, look at that. Dun, dun, dun. Die acquired. Green die. Uh huh. Oh, you can also go up here. A bonfire. <laughs> Ah, nothing here, but it looks like we could cross, right? Whee! Oh! Ho, ho. <laughs> Amazing how far we can go up here. I found another artifact. It's an instrument, a gem that may have been used in festivities or accompanied marching ar armies. Seems to have been heavily used with a lot of paint gone. So I guess you can just sell them, but it's still gonna be here with the ar with the the artifacts for your collection. Cool. Okay. If the game world is meticulously designed. All the buildings and landscape don't look random or procedure. No, it's uh, you can definitely see they they put lots of uh, love and work into this. Shard nearby. Yeah, we talk about this shard, right? Oh, maybe another one. Maybe it's actually even a cross. Oi, I, oh, wait. So many things to explore. Oh, yeah, my last open world game, that was uh, Kaku, I finished. Like, two weeks ago? That was amazing. I love that one. It was very fun to play. Wait, no, it's down here. Look at this, it's shiny. Looks are found in the northern part of Scandinavia. They definitely like the cold, and Germany is not that cold anymore. <laughs> Maybe it's this shard we're talking about? No, the no, that's another artifact. No, we're talking about the shard on the other side. Okay, what's this? It's um, garment making. We preserve pelts of an extinct animal from the time before Fellows reign. The first course, but the leather can be processed to be sold to vendors. I still not did not purchase anything with my gold, by the way. So how do you need to cross this one? There's something shiny on the ground. Looks like a, a church. Kinda. Ouch. No, there is... I don't think there is fall damage. Maybe. <laughs> something here. Could be our castle in here rising. We still wanna... <laughs> it sounds ambitious, but we still wanna get um, the game on, on Brutal. Germany is freezing, I wish, dude. I really wish. It's insanely hot. Oh, we can race this one, though. Oh, maybe they... Aha! Okay. We can already stand here. I'm so strong. And it's also nice that she's climbing a bit. Aha. Uh -huh. A padlock. These are, <laughs> these are everyday items. A padlock with a mechanism so intricate that many engineers would like to lay their hands on it. The craftsmanship is plain function but still impressive. Only 25 bucks though. All right. Don't mess it up. Me, me. Wee! Oh my God, I made it. Okay. It's right there. 
I wonder if you need to fight for it again. Probably. Another step. Yeah? We are getting closer to our goal. Da, 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 da. Wait, the compass is showing me vendor at 105 meters. And the moose? Is the moose something special? Huh. Your eyes are opened now. Yeah. So the next one would be over there. So I gotta go back then. Um Okay, I did drop. <laughs> I just jumped down, but I don't know if there's still fall damage. Maybe. A kite. Someone is calling for attention. Let there us is take a, a vendor. Look. That's a very interesting ad. Hello. Ah, we meet again. I thought that captain had killed you. Good. Perhaps you can lend me a hand. Um, sure. I can help. I can help, as long as it's not mm -hmm. some shady business. Shady? Never! <laughs> I am looking for rare materials for essence stones. It would be good to know more about them. And to that end, I have been thinking. Sometimes, Thelos brings their fury on the land, right? The Watcher flares up and... Well, I'd like to know what happens then. There could be some valuables there, just asking to be collected. I could give you some essence stone recipes from my collection ah. if you do this for me. Knowledge for knowledge. Sounds like a fair deal. If I discover anything, I will return to you. Is there any way to know when and where the Watcher wakes up? It is unpredictable, but seems to happen in open spaces like the desert more often. This sounds dangerous. We should make preparations before doing as he asks. Find better protection. Okay, that sounds dangerous. But let's see, what is he even trading? Trade. Okay, we're poor chat. <laughs> Idle wound. When you get it automatic, you regain a significant amount of the received damage as health over. <gasps> is health over three seconds? I'm having 225 coins only. Success parry regain a small amount of health. Mm hmm. Oh my god. This is the flower I need. Is this some kind of a or a plant you need? Is this some kind of a plant you can also find outside of the world or is it only purchasable? I cannot afford anything, chat. I'm so poor. Just like in real life. Did you know that many items of the past are still around? Yeah. And they are precious. I know many people who are willing to pay for them, and they pay well. So if you bring these items to me, your purse won't regret it. But as with every market, prices keep changing. Have an eye on the categories of the items, if you want to make as much as possible. Okay. Advance the following quest to proceed through forging the gauntlets. Defeat a Watcher's Fury. Fury, not furry. <laughs> Upgrade your armor. <laughs> okay, that's the side quest. Um, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll see if I can do it. Um, I got a cross Such now. Power. A shard is close. We should look for it. We should look for it, but I gotta go down again. Maybe the the. Oh. Ah, pay route. I thought I've uh, discovered a carrot. <laughs> so maybe... Oh, he's back again. So the moose is... Maybe we should k get the moose. Hello. Oh! <gasps> okay, you mother trucker. Maybe it's time to get uh, Deed's bacon again. Dude, I have no chance. How did I get the, him the first time? There aren't flowers looking for <laughs> special plants. Dude. This way. Okay, it's dead. Why did I do this? Where's the moose? I gotta do the same with the moose. Oh, it's gone. It's not on the map anymore. Oh, no, it's you're here. Wait, wait, wait. 
Maybe they're actually just... No, I don't want to kill him. But maybe there's something interesting here. I don't think I went to the right side. Oopsie. What's this? Nothing. Ah. Oh! Something shiny! Whee! I knew it. It's a writing tool. Uh-huh. This one, an ancient writing tool. This one has been rarely used and is coated with gold. Ooh. Yoink. Oh, there's even a temple down here. My god, this world is full of details. Huh. Oh, I gotta go down, chat. There's something shiny. <laughs> like one of those birds. Wink. But it's down here. Probably just an artifact. No, it was uh, money. Actually, money. 50 coins are 50 coins. And. Who's goggles? Hello, goggles. Hello. Welcome to the land of boredom. What can I do for you? What are you doing here? Twiddling my thumbs, mostly. I have sticks to play with. Fun times. Oh, right. By the way, could you do me a favor? I am supposed to report back to the village at some point. And it would be nice if you check with the other lookouts, too. I'll mark the location for you. If Keen Eyes asks, you can tell her I'm not bored to death. Yet. Can't speak for the others, though. Eyes in the desert, find the gate lookout. Follow the quest. Uh, quest at in Umbra. In Umbra, Igitur. Kuknabimus. Uh huh. I cannot open it though. Maybe for better. Oopsie. Dun, dun. All right. Let's get up again. Goodness, this uh, world is full of side quests, full of details. It's amazing. <laughs> Okay, um, <laughs> I had to go back somehow, I right? Will lend you my eyes. Thank you. Um, wasn't it here somewhere? Bacon, bacon boy's back. <gasps> oh! Wait, wait, wait. I, ca I cannot see the bacon. <laughs> the bacon, the beacon! Wait. It's also showing me that with the compass where to go. Players this way. Reminded to stay hydrated. Should we just go this way then? <laughs> the bacon. <laughs> Good reminder. Thank you so much. Cheers, thanks for reminding us to do something. It's insanely hard today, so let's do it. Uh, this reminds, this weirdly reminds me of Cage, but I haven't played Cage 2.8 and, um, hmm, Angel, you gotta help me out here. What are these standing for? K-H and M-O-M? -M? Mom? <laughs> Mom? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you don't mean Mom, right? Oh, Kingdom Heart! Oh, that's why! One of the games, y you see, I would, I should really start playing Kingdom Hearts. Oh, it's reminding you of Kingdom Hearts? Oh, that's interesting. Huh. Your eyes are opened now. Where's the oh the other big oh it's on our way anyway. What is this warm boy? A bit scared of warm boy. Old coin. Um old coin from the old kingdom that was taken by the sun to choose a winged creature and no sign at all of Philos. This one was minted in silver. Actually, we got quite a few artifacts now. Why is it saying diver and then it's looking like I can talk to this guy? Probably not. I'm gonna die now, right? Body parts. Oh, larger force you encounter have multiple body parts for you to. No! To target and destroy the alien health of the foes, body parts can be seen in the... Oh no! 
I gotta focus on that specific part. Oh my god, this game is okay. Hard. <laughs> Most body parts you encounter have shiny metallic pieces on them. And known as catalyst pieces. They are marked in red and destroying them all defeats you. Oh, of course, it makes sense. If you're getting the head, it's dead. Okay, body parts without catalyst pieces are marked in yellow. These do not need to be destroyed in order to defeat your foe, but they will be grant. They will grant you a higher chance to receive loot. Loot. Makes battle so much more done. Yeah, it's giving you definitely um See that metal part on its body. That a is variety. a core. A wraith with no core is a dead one. But I'm not seeing the other body part, or is it in front of me and I'm not seeing it? Oh, it's behind! Oi! Maybe I should... Oh my god, it's another foe is also attacking me now. Atosh! Atosh! Okay, it's, it's done. Dude, that ultimate is amazing! Oh, this is so satisfying. <laughs> we got a sun score. You just obtained in a sun score. The key component to fuse the sunstones. All larger foes have a descent to drop in a sun score. You're now able to complete the formula you obtained earlier. Ah. Oh. Fusion formulas are listed in your arsenal and marked with a small I scroll icon. On the right side of the screen, you can see which plants and minerals are needed to fuse with the core in order to create the sandstone. Oh, I got everything ready. So many tornado following your foes and damage. Oh my god! Biting sandstorm. Ha! Huh. Create the sandstone building X now. Okay, let's fuse. Boom. Yeah, we got it now. And um, it's this one. And we're going to place this one here. So you got to craft it. Aha! Uh -huh. We finally know how to create something new. Very, very cool. I wonder if these people are friendly. Idol of Shatter, your Shatter attacks attack heals you for a significant amount of the damage of the deals. It's actually super nice. Can I just do this now? Add many. This many contains your acquired idols. All idols have a unique effect, but also share the same core functionality of healing you. You can only have one idol. It, you can only have one idol equipped at once. So, um, what's this one? Idol of haste significantly increase the restoration rate of your idol. Then Rancor. When you get hit, regain a small amount of the damage you deal as health. Oh, that's so good. And shatter attack heals you for significant amount of them. Hmm. I'll take this one. They're gonna be so much more. Look at the the list. Huh. It really is. Yeah, it's super satisfying. Um feel the world around you. It is still showing this way. Let's see if they're friendly. Uh, they might be friendly. That must be Castrum 7. Perhaps somebody Hello? here knows more about the knights. Okay, they're friendly. Good. I hope the ones who got stranded are okay. Sorry. Just looking around. Oh, aha! Uh -huh. A Griffin figure in. Aha, uh -huh, I can see an alliance person. Mm -hmm. Small figure in depicting an animal of a long forgotten time. These griffins can also be seen in old pictures in which they protect buildings. They this may have been a toy. This figure the figurine is carved out of reddish wood, which is passionate attention to detail and excellent craftsmanship. Mm -hmm. Lucky thing good thing is they're all dead now, Chad. <laughs> What's this here? What's this? I can still hear the screams of those mm. who died here that day. Knights, people, with families, everyone full of courage, everyone desperate. The gauntlet. I thought I had a chance. We had a chance. I was reckless, stupid. The fight against Thelos can never stop. If we don't fight, we are lost forever i have to do better the knights have been waiting for the time to rise again i can't let them down this time but i can't expect everyone to follow me 
I must fight alone. Whatever it means. Whatever happens. Okay. That voice. Is she the one we saw in the vision? I believe she is. It is as if her memory was fused with the sands in this place. Funny thing is this game is kind of reminds me of Assassin's Creed. Like the, the first part. <laughs> Maybe because of the sand theme. Welcome to Castrum 7. Arif said you'd show up. I was told to let you pass, but that gauntlet doesn't inspire confidence. The Elder is waiting for you. He's on the podium by the well. Okay. There's also a village under here. From all over the world. If you want to head out to the desert, you'll have to. Perhaps you are interested in buying something from me? You I am poor, nice though. Traveler. I have an armor set for sale. An opportunity like that doesn't come around often. Uh, we would be able to buy a couple more, but I don't think we need to do that, though. No, we can get this probably. Nah. But it's good that you can buy some materials. I'm pretty sure you can also do this with uh, the plants we're missing. Or flowers, whatsoever. I just hope the watcher won't spew any rain nice. right into our village. Who's this? Are you gonna play Valhalla streamer? I feel like you have to with the Danish end. <laughs> I don't have Valhalla. No, I don't have this one. Um but maybe when it's on sale I could I could have a look. Yeah, why is why is Nubi not having that game actually? He said he would be interested in this one, but I don't think he he bought that one. Yeah, you should ask him, Judge. <laughs> Greetings, Arif told us you were coming. I'm not sure I like you walking around the village with that thing on your arm. I'll just keep it warning. <laughs> you look like you could use a hand. Honestly, how big is it? Well, my brother and my sisters Get are this. on their lookouts. Maybe good if Seven you could visit them. Seven million gigabytes. I'm not done meeting them all yet. <laughs> I'll let you know. I'll appreciate it. What's your story? How did you end up in the village? I was born in an essence mine under the worst circumstances. My legs were always weak. My parents died when I was six, and the mine collapsed over their heads, and I was put in a labor camp. There, I met the others. We became a family. Without them, I wouldn't have survived. We ended up in the village. It was Stade who found us and got us a place to live. Now we pay the village back by standing guard. All right then. We will talk later. Mm hmm. Advance the following quest to prove you through forging the gauntlets. Uh, find the desert lookout. Find the old outpost. Uh, this one. I still want to do this one though. Oh, you can also raise this one, I guess. The gauntlet is in oh, no is so cool. to attempt this. We require more oh. lost pieces. Oh, okay, never mind. I cannot do this one right now. So to speak. I'd say our options are limited and it's worth a shot. All right, I know information has been registered in your bus theory. Oh, that's Eric. And this is 07. I guess we need to talk to him. 160. It's 160 gigabytes big. I would not even be able to install it on my SSD, but my SSD is like 100 gigabyte or something. Yeah. Crazy. My games are getting bigger. Welcome to our castrum. Arif told me about you, so to speak. He said you were trying to unearth the passageway to Bastingar. Can I trust that thing in your arm is safe for us? Yes. We, um, I took care of it. It shouldn't cause any problem. Good. I am old seven. I try to keep things in order here, so to speak. But things are not how they used to be. Wraiths are everywhere, and many of my people were stuck in the wild after our bridges collapsed. We are working to get them a way to cross, so to speak. But I fear for our future. I'm trying to reach Bastingar. With my powers, my voice just I wake may be up. able to lift the gate out of the sand. If the knights are still there, you could find help. I will wait until I see it. But you bring hope, and that is a beginning. 
anything I can do to help, maybe? Is there anything you would have me do? I have something I think would be of interest to you, so to speak. Wraiths outside seem to be drawn by some magical artifact just outside the village. For now, the shelter stone protects us, so to speak. But we don't know how long it will hold. Ever since the Watcher awakened, we're all at risk. I will help with the, the wraith. The I wraith. Help with the wraiths. Where is this shard? It lies outside the west gate of the village. You can follow the road through the arch, so to speak. Who made the, sh the shelter stone? Do you know anything about the shelter stone, as you call it? Who made it? Lots of knowledge about chur, these chur. artifacts has been lost, unfortunately. They are from the dark. Oh, you can't see them. All I know is they emit some sort of magic that seems to keep wraiths at bay, so to speak. Interesting. Okay, about something else. Um, what can you tell me about your village? Anyone else in need of help, maybe? Just point me to people in need of help. I'll see what I can do. My son stayed in wreck. I help in need with overseeing the tasks of everyone in the village, so to speak. You'll find them down the village road tending to our livestock. If you want to help, they would be happy. A young man, Walker, also went missing recently. You can talk to his mother. She lives up the hill on your right. Thank you for caring. Any help you can give us is precious. Okay. Now we know a tiny bit more. Please come back when you have any questions. Okay. All right, old seven. Uh, defeat the watcher. Find the desert lookout. Uh -huh. Defeat the wraith. Uh, still, I want to get the the air ones, the air shards. Can you stay in air for several minutes? By the way, is that doable? Another anvil is close. Do you feel it? Because I cannot do that. Can you do this without being fighting? Without being in fight? Hmm, maybe you need to time it right. I wonder if you can float like this forever. <laughs> oh, hello. See many people. That God, I'm getting distracted by so many things. To our settlement. He usually sets up camp over there by the large tent. You can see his kite when he's here. It's because it's also a town, of course. Oh, an anvil! Nice. Uh, momentum gauge upgrade. Can we do that? Yeah. Um, sandstone sockets on the momentum gauge are unlocked. Using a sandstone, the cost of each consecutive unlock is increased. Select a locked sandstone socket and hold down X to unlock it. Oh! Current socket cost 100. Next socket cost is 485. We could actually do that. Same here. Now it's so expensive. Holy moly, it's so expensive. Wait a sec, you can also fast travel here. I was wondering if that's possible. And you don't need to pay additional each other, huh? Fast travel location unlocked. You can travel to other discovered anvils with an atlas. Fast travel is only possible when you are at an anvil. So, it's very important that you are finding them. And that's very cool. Very nice that you don't need to walk that much. I was a bit worried about that. Gauntlet upgrades. Um, in this menu, you can check the current status of your gauntlet. You are later you are later able to upgrade gauntlet abilities once you have collected the necessary parts. And this is what we're currently trying to get, but we have only one of third. Armor upgrades, nothing here, I guess. So we need more shards. Uh, perks, we could not get that one. Because we're still... Oh yeah, we need we need the perk a star. A gauge upgrade. But we can... No. How can I add the one I'm having here? No. Uh, it's not here. That's not perks. I just want to add another one in between. How can I do that? Compatible. Ah. 
Oh, I've got nothing. Oh, because I've got nothing for this one. Never mind. Okay, that was for nothing. Okay, unlucky. Great prices for great things. If you want to head out to the desert, you'll have to be well equipped. Hmm, I know. Oh, we can talk to him here this as well. Village has seen better days. Tracker always talked about this place when we passed through it. She remembered good times. You seem worried about her. Yes. But a more resourceful, skillful woman, I do not know. We must not give up hope. I am certain she is still alive. All right. How to get out of this town and finding my way up? Where is it even? I'm not even seeing it. It's saying it's... Oh, it's behind. Oh, it's right here. Looks like it trapped to me. Oi. Be careful around the shot. The wraiths are drawn to it. Oh, we can also talk to, to this oh, villager. Oh, no, that traveler with the artifact. Mm -hmm. Is it not dangerous to be beyond the walls? It is. But the shelter stones protect us. Thank you so much. This uh, tower you unearthed out of the ground seems like something we can use to climb down as soon as we dare to. Is it this Let one? Hope you see. Oh, it's showing here or something. What's this then? This one is warded by a spell. <gasps> um. being watched. I did not know that. We can get them right. Um, no, we're not done. Oh, I need healing. Oh, I need healing. What the hell? This moth is going crazy. We're not done yet. Changing tactics, I see. More parts for me to dismantle. I'm actually dying. I'm actually dying. I gotta get away. If we leave now, the wraiths will return as strong as before. Yeah, but I don't want to die. Ha. Huh. I need healing. I don't have potions. I think I did some risetti. Is this even the one I'm searching for? I need some healing. But there is something on the ground. <laughs> I dropped something. <laughs> I'm gonna check this out. Or is it this one? Maybe this is just decoration. This is super confusing right now because uh, the beacon is showing me exactly this one. But I think it's right in front of us and I need to fight against them. Oh yeah. This is not a good start, though, because I have no HP for this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I can hear my heartbeat. Can I get a potion or something? If we go too far, we would give our enemy the chance to recuperate. Huh. I want a regenerating intent. Oh, look at this. I found a, a chest here. Evasive bursts send out a damaging explosion at the end of your raid and air dash abilities. Can I equip this? Um. Oh, it's looking like that. End of your raid and dash abilities. 
actually super nice if I would dash a tiny bit more. I'm just jumping so much more. Maybe I should actually mm, get my defense higher. Oh, there you go. This is what I wanted to do. Yeah, this is what I wanted to do. Regenerating a tiny bit, but that's so much. Oh, chat. I gotta be a bit more prepared for this because <laughs> this looks quite hard. The villager was right. Maybe, because I also just looked at the time. Maybe this is also a good point to take a break. And I will figure out how to get my HP up again without without dying down there. Because this looks quite hard. So I will save here. I, I hope there was some automatic save. It's saying... Actually, it just saved a couple of seconds ago. I, I, I just saw. But um, I'm going to go back to the main menu. And I want to save. Thank you so so much for trying out one more time atlas fallen with me i'm i'm glad i went back again and giving you this game another go because the last time it was a year ago um of course i could not show the rain of sand that's probably the end game um area uh, a new end game area with new enemies with new quest lines so um i'm sorry about that